hey guys and welcome back to my channel so i have this cutest guy ever ow he scratch my face hey guys and welcome back to my channel so today i'm doing my foundation routine because i finally found a foundation that i'm like totally in love with so i'm gonna do my feet i'm not gonna do my foundation routine and basically show you what i use what i do okay anyways before we start off i want to show you something really cute which is oh he doesn't want to come up bitch <laughs> is my baby look come on look at the camera He's kind of scared right now, I don't know why. But I just wanted to show off my puppy. His name's Oliver and he's the cutest thing ever. He's so small and tiny and I just love him to pieces. We also have another, um, we have a sister as well. And her name's Bella, but she's eating right now. So I don't have her with me. But yeah, Oliver and Bella are both chihuahuas and I just wanted to show him off real quick because he's so cute and tiny. But and plus throughout the video like you'll hear in the background i think like them barking a few times i think i even said i'm like excuse like the barking in the back because they're crying they'll play with each other but they'll like start barking and crying because i guess they end up hurting one they end up hurting one another when they play because they play kind of rough but anyway besides that i'm talking a lot let's go ahead and throw the footage so i'm starting off by moisturizing my face which in my last video, I mentioned that I used the Pods Dry Skin Cream, which is this. And so yeah, I'm just gonna add that all over my face to moisturize it. So I forgot to bring back bring down a mirror so I'm using like this little one my Milani blush has like a mirror so I'm gonna have to use that which is really little but I mean I'm not gonna walk all the way back upstairs mm -hmm. so when I'm done moisturizing I go ahead and prime my face and I'm using the wet and wild wet and wild face primer Photo focus, and I'm just gonna go ahead and add that. As a drugstore primer, I really, really like this primer. I never had like the high end primer, so I don't know how good those are, but I feel like this is a really good one. Because I had a primer before. And I didn't like I, I just didn't work out. But with this one it works good. So. Next thing is I go in with my Fenty foundation. So look. And like once it came out I really wanted to try it, but I've been having dry skin lately and this foundation is like really matte. And I thought it would be good for me because you know, I'm oily, but I was taking medication, so I couldn't. I've been taking medication for my acne, which I said in my last video, and I, it gets me dry. So I didn't buy it because it just wouldn't, I thought it wouldn't work out. But I ended up going for it because this moisturizer, like I said, is really good and it's been actually really helping me. And I've been getting less dry every day, and I still take my medication. But I'm just like less dry, like I wasn't even, I was a little bit dry today, but not as much as before. So I decided to go ahead and just get the foundation and I was in love with it. Like it's so good. I was just like, I didn't get oily until, I did my makeup at 6 o'clock, 6 a.m. And I didn't get oily until like 7 p.m. That's so good, like. I don't know, it's just I was so I was shook. I was so surprised. So this is like my new favorite foundation. So I'm, so I'm gonna go ahead and I put like I just put some on my um, my 
hand just a little bit and I just use my finger to dab it on I'm gonna go ahead and work in sections. I'm using my beauty blender and I'm just gonna go. So I went ahead and zoomed you guys in so you guys can see how the foundation is looking. I only did one side, this side. I still keep looking up, I'm so dark. This side has a foundation, this side doesn't. Hopefully you can see a difference. You feel my And I'm still looking up uh, just so I can like know where I'm pointing at. Yeah, I have this scar right here. Okay. I will now be going in with my Lori I now <laughs> Okay, so now I'm going to be going in my Lori Mercier powder If it focuses But I'm going to be going in with that I finally got my hands in it I got me the little one Because the Sephora I was at They didn't have like the full size one So I just got like the little ones I'm guessing they have this because it's like I don't know if they always had like the little ones, but it was next to like the Christmas like stuff, like the Christmas items that they sell. And it was next to the Christmas stuff, like where they're all miniature sizes, like that you can put in stockings and stuff. So I don't know if it's mini size because of Christmas or because like they always had it, I don't know. But the full size wasn't there anyways, so could I not have gotten it? So for my new foundation routine, I do not put concealer. Shocking, but the reason I'm not is because um, when I got matte for my foundation, it like I finally feel like I found my right shade for my foundation like it just matches me so well so i feel like my concealer is just too it's just like too um light for me well that's why i just fill it with this concealer it's just too light and i tried it with it and it just did not look good it looked like a ghost like my under eyes just look like too pale my dogs my dogs play too much together, that's what they're barking. But, um. So I went ahead and set my whole face with the translucent powder. Now I'm just gonna dust it off. I first just put it all over my face and now I dust it off. I do not bake. I still do not bake because I just feel, I don't know. I just, I just haven't been baking lately. At first, it's because I had really dry skin. But now my skin's getting better, so I technically could bake. But I don't know. For now, I'm just not going to do that. I 
I am just so in love with this foundation, with this translucent powder. It's just so bomb. The only thing that really does suck though is I have I always crease right here and I used to never crease there before but now I do and I just don't know how like how to make it stop. Like it just annoys me so much because I don't know how to get rid of it. Okay. Anyways now I'm gonna be going in with the thing that I always use the NYC wheel is the color wheel and I use it to bronze up my face which I really do want to get a new product because I need to try new bronzers I've always just been using this one for the longest so I'm just going to go ahead and bronze up my face So I'm now done bronzing and I'm going to go in with my blush which I will be using the Milan I'll be using the Milani Luminoso um, So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and apply that Okay, so I went ahead and added the blush. Now going in with my Becca. Why do I always do this? I'm going in with my Becca highlighter, and the name's Opal. So I'm gonna go ahead. Have my Morphe M310 brush. Well guys, I went ahead and finished off the look. I put on lipstick, which I used the uh, um, NYX lipsticks and the shade, well the name is Exotic. So I went ahead and put that on. And once I'm done, I didn't show it on camera, but I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you guys. The way I set my face, like my foundation and everything, I go ahead and I put on um, the MAC. No, oh, it's okay, baby, I have my dog with me. I have put on, I spray on the MAC um, Fix Plus. And I just spray that all over my face and that's just how I set my makeup. And that's basically it. That's my foundation routine. That's all I do. I'm so in love with this foundation. It's just so good. And the um, the translucent powder is just so good. I wish I would have got it way sooner. But um, I'm just glad I finally now have a foundation that actually matches my skin tone. I feel like even though they say, oh yeah, it matches your skin tone and all this stuff. I feel like this foundation actually matches my skin tone. Like it actually does. But yeah, so I'm so in love with this foundation. It's so good. But that's basically it. Before I close off the video, I'm gonna show him again because he's so cute and tiny and little. Hmm. So cute. You're so cute and tiny. You're so cute and tiny. <laughs> okay. 
But anyways, that is it. Thank you for watching and bye. Say bye. Bye. <laughs>